Oh, uh, hello. Um, I'm Charles from JTEC, and today I'm going to be showing you parts of a piston. Now, the one I have to demonstrate with is um, quite busted. This came. Whoever owned this car really did not take good care of their engine. Um, that's pretty bad right there. And then this is busted. Alright, so we're going to start out. We got the head of the piston. That's this part right up here. Um, this part here, it's called the skirt. And this is the connecting rod. And there's usually a cap that goes on this, but as you can as you can see, it's broken. Um, these little metal rings here, well, that's they're piston rings. Um, there's two of them. This one here, and then another one that should go here, are to seal the piston to keep the uh, gases from getting out. And this in here is the oil ring, and it keeps the oil from getting into the chamber. Um, this part here is the piston wrist pin, and some can be free floating, like like this one. Well, some can be free floating, and there'd be a little sort of ring inside of here that would keep it from falling out. But this one is a pressed in, so you'd need a press, hydraulic press, to get that in there. Um, and all it does is hold the connecting rod to the piston head so you can, so it can move. Because when it, it goes up, then the rod comes and turns and pulls it down. So that's how it moves. And to measure the piston, you'd want to measure from this point to this point, And then you'd want to measure the rod. You're going to make sure all this stuff is balanced, too. And then this here, I believe, is the face. Um, it's where all the combustion happens. Um, but yeah, that's all the parts of the piston. I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching.